I escaped to America with $10 million of dollars in gold. That's how you financed this operation. That was a good idea to use atomic power. I'm glad to see you can handle it properly. I'd hate to think your decontamination chamber wasn't effective. My work has given me a unique knowledge of radioactivity, but not without costs, as you see. Yes. Your power source had our organization puzzled for some time. They are still puzzled, Mr. Bond. Not any longer. I sent a complete report. Look, Mr. Bond, you've not contacted your headquarters since you requested a Geiger count. But there are so many files open on you already, Dr. Nell. Our own, the CIA's, the one from the Tong Society that you robbed. When trouble comes, you'll find this is a very small and naked little island. An expendable little island, Mr. Bond. When my mission here in Crab Key is accomplished, I destroy it and move on. But the habit of inquiry is persistent. I see you're wondering why, where, when. I only gratify your curiosity because you're the one man I've met capable of appreciating what I've done and keeping it to himself. Just a minute. There's no point in involving the girl at this stage. She has nothing to do with us. Let her go free. She'll promise not to talk. No, I won't. I'm staying with you. I don't want you here. I agree. This is no place for the girl. Take her away. No. No. I'm no. sure the guards will no. amuse her. No. no. That's a Dom Perignon 55. It would be a pity to break it. For the 53 myself. Clumsy effort, Mr. Bond. You disappoint me. I'm not a fool, so please do not treat me as one. And that table knife, please put it back. Well, we can't all be geniuses, can we? Tell me, does the toppling of American missiles really compensate for having no hands? Missiles are only the first step to prove our power. Our power? With your disregard for human life, you must be working for the East. East, West, just points of the compass, each as stupid as the other. I'm a member of SPECTRE. SPECTRE? SPECTRE. Special Executive for Counterintelligence, Terrorism, Revenge, Extortion. The four great cornerstones of power, headed by the greatest brains in the world. Correction. Criminal brains. The successful criminal brain is always superior. It has to be. Why become criminal? I'm sure the West would welcome a scientist of your caliber. The Americans are fools. I offered my services, they refused. So did the East. Now they can both pay for their mistake. World domination, same old dream. Our asylums are full of people who think they're Napoleon or God. You persist in trying to provoke me, Mr. Bond. I could have had you killed in the swamp. And why didn't you? I thought you less stupid. Usually when a man gets in my way. But you were different. You cost me time, money, effort. You damaged my organization and my pride. I was curious to see what kind of a man you were. I thought there might even be a place for you with Spectre. Well, I'm flattered. I prefer the revenge department. Of course, my first job would be finding the man who killed Strangways and Quarrel. Unfortunately, I misjudged you. You are just a stupid policeman. Whose luck is run out? Well, they're waiting for you in the control room, Doctor, now. No hurry. They won't have started their countdown check yet. You won't get away with it this time, Doctor, no. The Americans are prepared for any trouble. I never fail, Mr. Bond. What do we do with him? Soften him up. I haven't finished with him yet. 